awesome job guys till now you have booked a domain you have booked the hosting you have changed the dns as well now it's time to actually install wordpress website or the wordpress platform first <music> So to do that, you have to log into your Bluehost panel and click on my sites, click on create site because obviously you won't see anything over here as you have never done anything. So click on create site and write any name, any name for your website and you can change this later on. So you can just proceed with anything right now. Don't waste your time much over here. So I will just write marketing with smile. I'll say learn, apply, share. And I'll say so in advanced if you want you can just insert all these things so what I'll say so the email which I'm going to use is test at the rate digital Pratik University dot com this is the dummy email which I'm going to be using for everything and the WordPress username is uh, let's say marketing with smile uh, all right and the password and click on next and now choose the domain all right, make sure this is empty. Don't mention anything in the directory. I'll show you the importance of this directory later on, but make sure right now there is not even a single dot. All right, make sure there is nothing over here. Keep it empty just like it is. All right, there would be a slash that is fine. That is by default and uncheck all these things. We can do it later on. We can install later on. So marketing with smile, whatever your domain is, choose that and click on next. Awesome. So you will get some detail over here like WordPress installed successfully and if it is then successfully you have installed guys. Congratulations. Yay. <laughs> so uh, see the website is this. Uh, the admin panel would be accessed by this particular link so you can save this. So people who are brand newbie and have never ever done anything like WordPress please save this link. This is your login link. To your backend the admin panel of your WordPress you should also be receiving an email so that's fine if you just miss out this link but make sure you copy this link and save it uh, in your uh, like like a bookmark or something or what you can remember is whatever your website is you can just write your website like this let's say marketingwithsmile.com and slash right backslash WP hyphen admin remember always always right this is the way you log into your wordpress admin so wp is for wordpress hyphen and admin so any websites wordpress login panel can be accessed or can be logged in by this url only your domain name hyphen wp or backslash wp hyphen admin that is what is written over here you'll see the username as well you will see the password as well so what i'll do is in the from the next on uh, the, from the next videos onwards i'll just log in or maybe i can just log in right now and show you how it looks like so i'll just hit this link and i will enter my username and password basically you have successfully installed your wordpress copy and that's what you're going to see so write your domain name slash wp hyphen admin so it will give you this panel you have to click on login with username and password and uh, all you have to do is type your username, marketing with smile, uh, unir, and I will write the password. Click on login. And there you go. All right. You will be able to see something like this. This is the dashboard. This is something which you only would be able to see. Your visitors won't be seeing this. Uh, however, you can just hover over here, move your cursor and click on visit link. And this is how your website should be looking like your website name would be on the top your tagline would be over here if you have inserted anything then there would be one post by default and then there would be something like this all right by default so this is how your website would be looking like and from the next videos onwards we'll just try to customize this and create a beautiful website